Gator Tribe! Thanks for joining me in today's ICAD challenge. It's day eight and I'm going to be tackling both the ICAD and the mixed media ICAD prompts. So the regular ICAD prompt is umbrella and the mixed media ICAD prompt is mosaic. And I'm just shuffling through my cards just to just see if which one work will work best and I'm just gonna go ahead and go with this pink one because it doesn't matter because I'm gonna be creating something completely off the cuff for this challenge so I'm creating a scrappy template of a raindrop and pulling out some paper I'm using some just basic blue construction paper and then I've pulled an envelope liner as well for um, an additional contrast for my raindrops. So I'm basically laying out these raindrops um, on the card in a um, downward pattern and then I'm taking in those uh, envelope liner raindrops and I am coming in between the blue drops and placing them um, in an upward pattern to create my mosaic pattern <laughs> so much pattern making so you're about to see me do a lot of cutting out and a lot of placement and um, I'm gonna put this to music for this portion of the video while you watch I'm getting all of my raindrops um, wrapping this up getting them placed and um, completing the mosaic pattern next I will be putting together um, a basically a paint wash first I'm gonna apply a light blue gelato and I decided I that wasn't doing the effect that I wanted so I took some turquoise paint and uh, watered it down and I'm just coming in in between all of those raindrops and filling it in with that color in the same way that you would actual mosaic tiles with grout um, that's what I'm doing here with the paint so I'm coming in and filling in all those gaps with that wash of paint now I'm using an, a light blue acrylic paint pen and I'm just taking and drawing um, a little raindrop outline only on that blue construction paper uh, drops just to make those pop a little more um, with that uh, that paint wash that I just put down onto the card and I feel like this really creates um, the best way for this um, mosaic um, prompt so to speak in mixed media so it just really gives that look as if these were little tiles. So now I'm coming in with my umbrella portion of the prompt. I hand drew this umbrella and um, putting it there onto the card. I decided I want this little cross hatchy pattern, but I don't want to have to draw it because I don't have time. <laughs> so I found this other envelope liner and I'm just placing that down with collage and um, creating my umbrella with this uh, envelope liner and then I decided it needed a pop of color but first I'm coming in with um, my uniball pen and just doing some outline work just to make that umbrella stand out a little more and then I grabbed my Faber-Castell water soluble crayons and came in and began to color the umbrella in a sort of rainbow pattern um rainbow colors and um i thought this was a really great contrast to that background and it's also bright cheery and very happy so all the things that we're here for right now i'm coming in with um some more acrylic paint pens and just outlining each of those rainbow colored sections of the umbrella once I do that, I will um, do one more last little outline around the umbrella and then I'm going to place some found words from a book page. 
so while I'm doing that, I just want to go ahead and say thank y'all so much for watching. I really appreciate that you're here. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to become a part of the Tater Tribe. Also, join me over on Instagram and Facebook at taterize.sassmouth. If you want to know more about this challenge, check out the description box below. It has all the information about Daisy Yellow iCAD Challenge as well as Nina Fickett's uh, Mixed Media iCAD Challenge happening over on Instagram. So check those out. Also, if you want to see what I have created throughout the week, I have a playlist here on the channel. Check that out from day one all the way through today, day eight. Again, I appreciate y'all being here and watching Thanks for joining me, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye!